Hi, my name is Scott Franks, and I'm a partner with a company, a new company called Azuna. That's A Z U N A. We are located outside of Philadelphia. Philadelphia. We have a patented 3D print technology in a market today that's getting more and more flooded with 3D from a television and graphic standpoint. We decided to set the print industry on its ear, moving to a 3D patented process. It's very difficult to see here. However, it's got three to four inches of depth in a piece that's that thick, about 23 mils. The way we do this is we have, with this process, uh, extruded polypropylene, recyclable number five material that's extruded with thousands and thousands of microscopic cells on the top. The printing then takes place on the back with our process and the computer programs to run it. Azuna does the design and then does the proofing and does the final printing. The applications are many. We're in large box retail stores with notebooks that are 3D. We have a 3D dry erase board. We just launched 3D cups in movies in conjunction with Coke and Cinemark theaters. Um, in the commercial area, point of purchase, advertising inserts, direct marketing, just about anything that you can print 2D, we can make 3D and make it more impactful. We're excited about it and hope you will be too. Interesting. Can you show us some of your other products? Sure. This is our 3D cup. Mm -hmm. This is what we call our Generation 2 material. We're extruded into this substrate is actually the 3D itself. Mm -hmm. When you then print on this, where you don't want to see the 3D in the bubbles, mm -hmm. you'll lay down an opaque white print behind the primary visuals. The result is an impact, an inexpensive, a top shelf dishwasher safe, recyclable, collectible cup. This is cover of a notebook that will appear in a retail store near you. It's from Alice in Wonderland. Wow, look how beautiful that is. And you can't see it so much in the video because of the camera, but it really is 3D. And these flowers are just coming out at you, and you can see her dress. And all of the pattern, it just has a depth. You think you feel like you could reach right into the scene. Well, I might add that glasses are not needed. <laughs> as much as I'm in here with a show, where every other booth has 3D glasses, no 3D glasses are needed to see the depth and the clarity mm -hmm. of this particular piece. Now tell me about the materials that it's made for and the whole recycling aspect. Well, we're, we're proud that this is about as green as it can be. <laughs> we need polypropylene because that's the material it was invented on. Mm -hmm. The material is also recyclable in, in number five. But we find that these things do not get thrown away. They don't find their way to landfills. They find their way as a person's bookmark, on a refrigerator, in a desk drawer, on somebody's desk. I've got calls from people a year after they've received samples and said, I've been showing this to people waiting for an application for a year. And it's just it's just that way. So we're we're proud. It's it's not as green as, as a paper in its recyclability, but I'll tell you what, this plastic uh, is number five and hangs around for a long, long time. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you so much.